Please and view into all my viewers and subscribers and you don't know it's a boy Nagi and right now what I want to share with you this is about um, Makul official again as you may say that um, fast rising sensation as you may say we have um, the whole social media in a frenzy since of lately as you may say yeah the same girl we talk about take people man and people man nice well what I have to share with you Makul stated that she take people man and have sex with them for her money but she is not a prostitute as you may she also said that she believes in God but God has to approve what she is doing because deacon, pastors, etc. are doing it too. She has no intention of stopping because this is her income. Prostitution is not only one of the oldest professions but one of the most common professions. What makes a girl a prostitute? Is it the mere fact that she is collecting money or assets for her sex? If the answer is yes, then this world is being overrun by prostitutes. Hear me say no my viewers and subscribers. This is Mockrill's interview on Jenny Jenny and this is what she had to say. Check in. No, Jenny. Yeah, you know. Let me say a little bit of you to talk to you. I don't know if you can talk to you. I don't know if you can talk to you. I don't know if you can talk to you. I don't know if you can talk to you. I don't know if you can talk to you. When you get older and you look back at your life, like, like now you are 18 years old, you're going to be 28 if the Lord blesses you with long life. You're going to be 38, 48. Is this what you want to remember that you did with your youth? Well, yes. We enjoy it for you, my woman, man. It's not going to bother you when you're 50 years old that you did this at 18. Mm -hmm. And you're not afraid of getting the diseases. You do know condoms can burst, right? Yes, yeah, you know. You know, you can see what I have to do now. I didn't hear what you said. Say it again. I was saying, you know, you can do it, you can see the man, and I have said. Oh, I'm a idiot. She keep her mouth and just a carrot. Oh, so, oh, forgive me. She has a lie down with them. You're supposed to know. So you have sex with some of them, or you don't have sex with some of them? Mm-hmm. I don't care about them apart, then, then. So, so, so when you become older, it's not going to bother you that this is what you did as a young person to make a living what about what about the skills that you have are you planning to use that at all how long are you planning to take people's man as an income for the rest of your i'm going to answer a question that people are going to say really jenny <laughs> you believe in god Oh yeah, Jenny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You believe in God? Yeah. So do you think God? Oh, so do you think God approves of what you're doing? Well, Jenny, God has got to be for me, no girl. The pastor is deacon, so body has been Jenny. Have you ever had a relationship with a pastor and a deacon? That's what I lasted. Lasted, last agenda. You know that? No other. Okay, so so how can you speak definitively about what pastors and and deacons are doing? I have. You have never experienced that, so therefore you, you, you can't say that about the people then, because because you because you don't trust doesn't mean that other people are doing what you're doing. You see, I can be the new and the kind of do them. You see, yeah, you do have some of them. There's no denying that. But if you believe in God and you believe God doesn't approve of what you're doing, you don't think that you really at some point in time need to change your life, especially you have a son. You don't want your son to see mommy doing this. Your son is not going to respect you. You know that, right? When he gets older and sees that this is what you're doing for a living, you know it's not going. You know it's prostitution, right? Oh yeah, plan for So when he reach, okay, how old is your son now? Four. Four. So you're planning to change when he reach about eight? Four more years of take people's mind. I'm trying to understand what. You cannot. You cannot tell me what. You know. And everything you need to tell you know. Can you can you cannot take people man and you know you know. So you know, like you and so on. But you're different. So so social media though means that it's going to be out there for the rest of your life. And he can go and search. And this this generation is a social media generation, the millenn millennials we call them. He's gonna see it. So First, when you see it and say, Mommy, but you're a prostitute, what are you going to say to him? Because you do know it's prostitution, right? You know you're a prostitute, right? Can I go Yeah? 